Today we're here for the Elizabeth Garrett Anderson final celebration event at Green Park in Reading. We're here for the um, celebration at the end of our Elizabeth Garrett Anderson master's degree in health leadership. Uh, two years of really hard work, been really enjoyable but this is the time now to celebrate. be able to continue to influence my teams, to be a very patient focused leader. It's been completely life changing really. The thing with Elizabeth Garrett Anderson is I've always spent most of my career looking at leaders around me and, and trying to emulate different practices and different behaviours and trying to be like other people and actually what this programme has given me is that you need to embrace and accept who you are as yourself and learn to understand yourself and then just try to be the best version of yourself that you can. It's been so useful, in particular the assignments that we were asked to do have really challenged my long-held perceptions about things, for instance uh, patient-centred care, trust and what we mean by compassion. It's really lovely to see everybody. It feels like we haven't been together for a while and there are a lot of people here that have uh, really, really helped me on my leadership journey. Having completed the course, I feel really pleased because I feel I've got a range of tools now that I can use um, as a leader going forward in the NHS. It has already impacted quite a lot in what I do. I'm much more mindful about some of the leadership decisions I've made. This programme has given me opportunity to talk to a, a wide variety of different roles within the NHS, make friends, understanding how things work. It really brought out who you are, it showed you your potential and it allowed you to look at things differently, look at a scope for the future and be able to move on and build from that. Today, I feel a sense of achievement. The driving here this morning made me understand where we began, how far we've all come, not just me, um, but as, as, as a group um, and as a cohort. So yeah, a sense of joy. Completing the course means a great deal to me because I think before I was winging it, I, I was pretty effective as a, as a person, an employee of the public sector, but actually now I feel I've learnt more about how to get things done that are true to my values in a way that gets people motivated as well. I'm very pleased to have had the opportunity to have undertaken the Elizabeth Garrett Anderson programme. I think most of us would say it's been a challenge, um, there's been tears and tantrums along the way, but now that we've got to the end of our two years it's certainly been worth the pain. The highlight is definitely finishing, but actually learning about myself and learning the emotional intelligence really, that's the, been the biggest thing that I've learned throughout this course. in such um, a whole diverse group of leaders from um, all sorts of walks of life within the, within the NHS and care services has been, has been fantastic. The best part of the course has been patient experience and team effectiveness. Because if we target the team effectiveness or target the team, we are able to get the quality of care we are looking for. I think the most important takeaway has been meeting um, the, the group of people that I have, particularly within my ALS. So I think a lot of what Anthony said to me this, or said this morning, um, in, his, in his unique way, um, really, really resonated with me. been a fantastic experience and actually I feel quite sad that we're coming to the end of our journey together. <laughs>